Hi everyone, Asan again. Welcome back. This is lesson 7 of my maths help that's brought to you by me and Joyous Learning. Um, in case you missed my previous video, I told you guys that I was an alumnus of Joyous Learning in P3. Today we have a speed question, but not cars, as in printing question, and let's see the question. One machine took 70 minutes, while another took 100 minutes to print the same number of copies of a newsletter. The faster machine printed 6 more copies of the newsletter per minute than the slower one. Question A. The slower machine completed the job at 1pm. At what time was the printing started? The slower machine is the one that took a longer time, which is the second one which took 100 minutes. Question A. 100 minutes equal to 1 hour and 40 minutes and 60 minutes is equal to 1 hour. Since the job was completed at 1pm, we have to write that on the, at the end of the graph, so 1pm. So we are going to do it one by one. Um, reverse 1 hour first, then reverse another 40 minutes. So 1pm reverse 1 hour becomes 12pm. And then 12pm reverse 40 minutes equal to 11.20am. And that is the answer for question A. Now, question B. What was the total number of copies printed by the two machines? First, we need to find out the number of copies each machine has to print. So they say that the faster machine printed 6 more copies of the newsletter per minute than the slower one. Since the faster machine took 70 minutes, we are going to take 70 times 6, which is equal to 420. So that is how much more the faster machine printed in 70 minutes than the slower one. So we have to take the time taken for the slower one, which is 100 minutes, minus the time taken for the faster one, which is 70 minutes, to get 30 minutes. Because in the end, they printed the same amount of sheets. That's why the slower one took a longer time to print the same number of worksheets. So, which means the slower one takes 30 minutes to print 420 copies of the thing that they are printing. So in order to find out how much each machine has to print, we have to find out 100 minutes of the slower one. So, 30 minutes is 420, so we have to divide it by 3 to get 10 minutes because 100 is not a multiple of 30. So divided by 3, 10 minutes becomes 420 divided by 3 is 140. Divided by 3 is 140. And 10 minutes times 10 to get 100 minutes. So 140 times 10 Basically, just add one zero. Then you add one zero. So that is the amount each um, photocopying machine has to print. Since there are two machines, you have to take one thousand and four hundred times two, which is equal to two thousand and eight hundred. And that is the answer for question B. That is it for today's lesson. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope you benefited from it. And if you found my previous videos and today's video good, the ones at Joyous Learning are even better, go to www.joyouslearning.com.sg slash blog to find out more about it. And I hope you're having a great day and I'll see you next week. Bye-bye.